Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It has been a very, very long time since I've uploaded on this channel. Almost two months now. And there is actually a good reason for that. Two good reasons as to why I haven't been uploading on this channel. And one of them actually has to do with the fact that I've kind of just lost love and interest for self-improvement content on YouTube. Now, before you get mad at me, I think that self-improvement is an awesome aspect of life. And it's something that everyone should do, 100%. Self-improvement is a very, very important aspect of life, and everyone should have the desire to keep improving themselves in their life. However, I think that the content, like the self-improvement content and the self-improvement space on YouTube is just a bit, like, dry and old now. Like, it's been on YouTube since, like, what, 2020? I think that's around the time that it started getting popular. And I just don't, like, it's, it's very almost like monotonous and repetitive now and there's really like there's only so many videos uh that you know you can make about like relationships and you know how to improve yourself and all this stuff before it just kind of gets repetitive and it's like okay i've already heard this on like several other channels like what makes this one different right because every single person who like no matter how like what stage they are in life can actually make self-improvement content uh like i might not be as you know successful or as, or as popular as like someone like andrew tate or you know some other big self-improvement you know influence out there but i can still say the same stuff as him um everyone can do that and i just feel like because of that because of that so and obviously i did this for a long time i did this for almost a year right I feel like because of that, it's just started to get very repetitive and there's almost really no value in self-improvement anymore. And I, like, it, it's just, it just doesn't interest me anymore. Like it, I look back, uh, I've actually, I took a good look of, you know, the, the videos on my channel. I took a good look at it and I realized that it's just not like exciting me anymore. Like I, I, I'm not excited to sort of talk about self-improvement anymore. Uh, I still think that's an extremely important uh, you know, thing of life. It's it's very, very important to do. I just don't care about it anymore. And I don't think there is sort of like a need for me to make that sort of content anymore. It's not really my, my, my purpose anymore, if that kind of makes sense. And I guess the main reason is because, you know, I, I've i made, I've made 60 videos on this channel so far. Like, they, they all follow the same format. It's like me being sad or me being down, um, down in the dumps, then me doing something, and then me becoming happier. And if you do the same thing that I did, you will also become happier. And I just realized, and this, this is not just like, I, it's not just me that who did that did this. It's not just me who did this. It's basically every other self-improvement YouTuber out there. They tell you, you know, they were sad, they were in a bad place, they did this, and then they, um, you know, they're, they're now in the position that you wanna be, that the viewer wants to be in. And then they basically try to sell them what they did uh, maybe like, you know, sometimes they'll monetize that, but basically they try to, uh, sell the audience, uh, to do what they did to get to like the end goal that everyone wants to be in. And it's very anecdotal. It, it's extremely anecdotal because it's like, um, I, you know, in, for example, my videos, I said like the, my, my most, my most popular video right now is how I grew taller. And that's when it really struck me. I was like, I, you know, I did all these things. Like I, you know, I worked out, I, I ate a lot of food, I slept for 10 hours a day. But like, I'm at an age where it's like, I, I'm 16 and I've stopped growing, I've completely stopped growing. But there are people out there who haven't grown at all at 16 and they start growing at like 21, right? So I realized that the, 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 the advice in that video, especially in that video, all my other videos, but especially in that video, was extremely anecdotal because it's only applied, like it's only based on my personal experiences. Like I didn't do any research in that video. I don't do any research in any of my videos. I just say what worked for me, and then I basically try to sell the audience saying, hey, if you do this, you might, you know, experience the same things that I do. And while there's nothing inherently bad in that, it's not useful to everyone. It's it's only gonna impact a certain group of people, a very, very small group of people. And while that, I guess that is good, it's just not what I want to do. I don't want to just, I don't want to just give advice based on what I did. I would rather, I'd much rather have different types of people commenting on different types of things. I'd, I'd much rather have like my, my circle 
um, be full of different types of people and with the, the different opinions and the different viewpoints. Uh, I'd really like my audience to be that way. Uh, and, you know, obviously the content that I was making wasn't really doing that. And so I, so I basically just took a break. Uh, that's not the only reason. The other main reason was because I was flooded with uh, assignments and exams in college. Uh, that's a topic for another day. We will talk about that. Uh, but I, I, I just basically took a break and I just looked at YouTube, like all the YouTube videos. I looked at the YouTubers that I really liked. I looked at the YouTubers that I wanted to be like, I, not not like, you know, subscribe account. Like I ignored subscribe accounts completely. Uh, and I just looked at YouTubers that I would make, I would want to make content. Like what YouTubers do I want to make content? Like what YouTubers do I want to be like? And, you know, I basically did that for almost two months and it, it really cleared my head. And it really like, because when I was making content, when I was making self-improvement content, I was completely like, I wasn't thinking straight at all because I had completely, like, I was basically influenced by so many um, self-improvement YouTubers. I was influenced by, you know, a lot of the self-improvement YouTubers to make a certain type of video, um, certain types of videos to basically be, like, validated by them. And, you know, I, after I broke through that chain, I realized, oh, okay, this is really not for me. So I really started looking uh, at the YouTube landscape. I really started looking at the videos that were like trending and the videos that really caught my eye. And it really helped me think, uh, and again, I'm not like, this is not me giving advice. This is just me reflecting. It really helped me think like, you know, and really helped me think straight and cleared my head as to what I actually really want to do with this channel. Um, because again, like self-improvement advice, everyone can give self-improvement advice, right? Like, but but the truth is, Self-improvement is going to be different for every single person. One piece of advice, one piece of self-improvement advice is not going to be the same for every single person in this world. It's not. Um, because self-improvement and, you know, improving yourself is yourself. It's literally called self-improvement. It's not just called improvement. It's called self-improvement. So me giving advice to, let's say, a thousand people on what to do is not going to benefit every single person in the same way that it did me. And that's what I thought it was going to do, but obviously it's not, right? Because it's it's going to be different for everyone. So I kind of realized that I don't want to do that. Instead, what I want to do is basically just give my opinion out there in this world. Make a change in this world by basically just giving out what I think. Giving out, you know, not just advice, but also just giving my personal opinion um, to, like, things, in the, in the, things that are currently happening in the world right now things that, you know, I'm interested in, even myself, just talk about myself, talk about the things I'm interested in, talk about the things that are happening in this world, give my opinion on it, um, start discussions. That's really like what I want to, that, that's basically like my new sort of found um, purpose right now is to do, is to just give my opinion out there, just say what I want to say, say my mind, speak my mind, just say stuff, just, you know, throw stuff out there, see what people think. That that really is what I really want to do. I feel like self improve making self improvement com content was a good start, but especially if you go to my older videos, they they were just not good. Like I I didn't know what I was talking about. I just heard like some some sort of you know advice from someone else. I had no idea what they're talking about, but I thought, oh okay, you know, if I if I take you know that that video got two million views. If I take that advice that he said in that video and then post it in my video, I'll get a million views. But of course, that's not how that works. I want to be as authentic as possible. And what I really mean by that is just talk about things that I like, um, things that are on my mind. Just say what I just say what I want to say. That's really my new sort of found um, interest right now. Yeah, that's basically about it. I'm going to stop yapping now and uh, probably think about some new video ideas that I want to do. Oh, and also one last thing before I forget. I have quite a lot of videos basically um, sort of lined up. Uh, to be up still to be uploaded on this channel uh, They were created months ago, and I never really got the time to edit them and make the magic to upload them And so they've basically just been sitting uh, for two months and I'm going to upload them But those are gonna be the last self-improvement videos that I upload um, And I think they're alright, but again, I just like yeah after those after that moving forward It's um, gonna be a lot different. So yeah, that's really about it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video